your name and address, and we are here to listen to you, and we will definitely respond um, after the meeting, or you can make an appointment, we will, or have staff follow up, we have all kinds of ways to, to follow up with you, so anybody at all, like, I don't know if there's anybody on the sign-up sheet, but no, no takers today. <laughs> Okay, but if you would let me indulge me, I would like to say, uh, clarify one item before we begin our agenda um, further, and that is because every day this week, um, including today, people have asked me, um, what is going on with the administrator? And Channel 10 apparently is doing an exclusive interview and has put the promo out there that um, is a little deceptive in uh, that there is a problem. And so I just want to clarify for the for the good of the order and the record and whoever's listening, that there's absolutely nothing deficient in the job performance of our county administrator. And in fact, as far as the board is concerned, um, we are completely satisfied with quality and quantity of work being done. Um, and I just think this kind of, I've never squelched anybody's First Amendment rights. They have ever, anybody has a right to say anything they want. Uh, but this kind of, it's, it is fake news as we hear so much more of, but it is fake news, and I think it's very destructive to everybody involved and to um, to the public. So I just want to clarify, because even this morning, uh, a little local media uh, editor came up to me, found me distinctly and said, what is going on? And there is absolutely nothing. We are completely satisfied as a board with our administrator, and, um, and so uh, I don't know what the article will, or the interview will bring forth but and I haven't even seen the promo but it's it's pretty misleading apparently so just wanted to bring that up before we move on so I'm moving on to our consent calendar then got that out of the way